This is my first time in Europe and we're in Rome. Rome is supposedly the most visited city in Italy. It is also the capital of Italy, which is very interesting. And it's filled with monuments and statues and the Colosseum, which is the most iconic thing I think in Rome. So today we're gonna spend the whole day visiting and exploring. Ideally, my vacations are usually surrounded by the beach. It's not usually exploring the city and the history of cities because that's not necessarily what I love to do. But today, because we're in Rome, that's what we're about to do. Enjoy. The train ride from Rome Airport to Rome Termini, which is the train station in Rome, was about 30 minutes. And then we had a five minute, five to seven minute walk from the train station to the hotel that we were staying. This is a very small elevator. Well, it can fit one person and a bag. We just got to the hotel and we can't check in yet. So we're going to try to find some food. Burn some time until two, then we come back, change, get ready for the day. Everywhere you go, you can find Jamaica. Oh, is that possible? They're probably not Jamaica. Hey man, what's going on right here? See, you Jamaica? Uh, how are you? You're Jamaica? Jamaica. Oh. He's not Jamaican at all. places to stay in Italy we couldn't find any videos of any of the places that we're staying this hotel is called um what's the name of this hotel again this hotel is called Hotel Mark Antonio Rome so it's a nice little hotel you know as you can see very small gonna give you an idea of how big the hotel room is <laughs> it is really one two three four five steps wide or long five steps long and one two three four four steps wide we bought a room city bus tour so that's what we're waiting on right now Nobody's on this bus. Alright guys, so we're on the tour bus now. Mm -hmm. And we're about to drive around and see the Colosseum, see Vatican City. And this is how we're gonna learn about the history of this place. Yep. This is a church called St. Mary Major. It's dedicated to the Virgin Mary and it's the largest church in Rome. because this place that we're going to know, the Colosseum, they had slaves fighting in there and killing each other. And now we're gonna view it as if it's cool. Slaves, gladiators, prisoners, separated by social class. See, I'm learning my history. I'm learning something here. 
good or bad. <laughs> I think the Coliseum and the Trevi Fountain for me are the biggest ones, so... The Colosseum is over 1,900 years old. It's the second great wonders of the world that we've seen so far. We've seen Christ the Redeemer in Brazil. Well, and now we're seeing the Colosseum in Italy. Approximately 400,000 people have died in the Colosseum. Rome is hot. It's a lot warmer than we thought it would have been, right? Well, Which is good. This great monument is the largest monument in Rome and it is to honor the first king of Italy. The monument is approximately 250 feet high and 450 feet wide. It is located in the city square, dead center of Rome. This is the first city we've seen with so many monuments. I know we say we don't like history, but I'm already blown away. The monuments are, you can't deny it. So rich in history and architecture. My mom would love it here. Well, Definitely. she would love the architecture. Definitely. Oh, this is crazy. Even if you're not into this type of stuff, it's still really cool. Across the river is a Vatican City that we didn't get to explore because we didn't have enough time, unfortunately. Jet lag. In the sun, we're trying to get to Trivi Fountain as fast as possible. But are we gonna make it? The sun is almost already gone. Yep, this is one of the main stops that we needed to do. But we're gonna go either way. Yeah, it might be it's better. Might, it might be better yeah. after it's probably pretty in the night. Yeah, exactly. Let's hope it's pretty in the light, but we're heading there. Trevi Fountain is known as one of the most stunning fountains in the world. The fountain generates approximately $1.5 million a year from tourists throwing money into the fountain and the money is donated to charity. It's a crime to thief the money out of the fountain so do do it. <laughs> craziest thing just happened to me. Yeah. All right, so. The drone took off, see? The drone took off, I'm flying. I went down one of those small roads because I didn't want like, the police to see me or eh? a lot of people walking around because of busy time. So I went down one of those small roads, you see me? Put the, the drone up in the air, but you know the small roads, the buildings are close. Put the drone up in the air, it went high enough, but I was losing signal. I was losing signal to the, the, the thing, to the drone from the remote. And all of a sudden, the drone just started going left. Left, left, left. It cleared the building to drop down on the floor, but hit the roof. Oh, my drone crashed on the, on the roof. 